Hi everybody, this is a quick video that I thought I would make uh, to show you how to add readers to your blog and how to read other people or follow other people's blogs. So I thought I'd use uh, this little tool which is called Cam Studio to uh, do kind of a screen scrape for you. And Cam Studio is open source and free. So uh, let's get started. I'll just close this tab and uh, oh, whoops, what's this doing up here? Let me just get rid of that. It, oh, this is what I was spending my time on. Uh, but anyway, we're here to talk about blogs, so let's go over to here. Uh, and when you log into Blogger, the first thing you should see is a page that looks like this. This is your dashboard. Uh, and at the top of your dashboard will be blogs that you have. I have three under my account. Um, and below is a reading list. Now, you can add other blogs to your reading list. And I'm going to show you that in a moment. First, I'm going to do is show you how to invite people to read your blog. So I'm going to go into my MP Blogger Workshop, which was a blog we created to help show people how to get one started, which is kind of a, a little redundant, I suppose. Uh, and when I'm in this area, so now the dashboard for a particular blog, if I go to Settings, one of the options I have under Permissions is who can read my blog. Now, right now, it's listed as anybody. But if I were to edit that and say only certain people could read, I could then add readers and invite somebody. So for instance, if I wanted to invite Kevin Whitney, I'd start typing his name on, it should pop up, and I can say save changes, he'll get an invitation. But since my blog readers is set to anybody, I don't really need to have a reader list. That's just kind of a formal way to invite people if you'd like to. So let's pop all the way back to our original dashboard. And instead, I'm going to add blogs that I would like to read. So I'm just going to click on the Add button here. And it'll say, well, which blog would you like? Give me a URL. So I will add, uh, how about my physics blog, mpphysics.blogspot.com. And I can either choose to follow it publicly, so the person who owns the blog would know I'm following it, or I could follow it anonym anonymously. I'll follow it publicly because I'm a bit narcissistic and hit follow. And now what should happen is I will get kind of a stream of some of the most recent, recent posts to that blog down here. And if I were to have a few blogs that I followed, so for instance, if I added uh, instededucation.blogspot.com, and follow that, I'll have that post come up more recently since uh, this happened about a second ago, whereas my physics blogs kind of ended a little while ago. You can also get, kind of edit some of your settings over here so I can change how I follow this. The only problem is we do not have a Google friend set up through our network, so you're not going to be able to use that. But uh, every once in a while, Blogger and Google update some of the things that you can do, so it's worth checking in to see what might happen there. But anyway, that is how you add blogs to follow, and also how you invite people. Hope that you found this helpful.